So I'm in the shelter right now. Nobody here. They all left this morning. There's a couple people still out there, but I'm in the lean to. It's day eight. Oh, I think it's a 9.9 .9 mile today. Gotta go over Chairback Mountain. Or the Chairbacks, I guess, or whatever it's called. I don't know. Um, wasn't able to make a close out video last night because there's people here and just didn't do it. But got through yesterday, got on the camp at like 12.30 a, uh, 12.30 p.m., something like that. So we hung out all day, um, started a fire when the rain let up, dried our clothes, and uh, we hung out and just shut the shit. It was kind of cool. So 9.9 .9 miles a day, a lot of down in the morning, got across a river, like a um, 100 foot wide river. That's like a shin to ankle, I think shin to knee deep. And then uh, um, then go up and, and then to lean to. So it's like, I think 10 miles roughly. So I'm gonna get packed up and then uh, I'm gonna get rolling. Oh, let me zoom out. Oh, shoot. Um, here is the agenda for today. <clears throat> Going to that chair back gap lean to today, 9.9 .9 miles. Just got on the trail at 6.30, a little after 6.30. It's early for Dave. Um, <laughs> he knows me, I'm a night owl. So anyways, uh, should be a, I don't know. I don't know what today brings. Sun's out. That's good, because I'm soaked still. Um, tense wet. Everything's wet. Disgusting. Uh, I'll talk about that in a future video, but right now I'm just looking forward to getting to Monson in a few days. Some people may be pushing um, today instead of the 9.9. .9, they might be doing like 18, maybe, and trying to get to Monson tomorrow instead uh instead of pushing it out to another night but i really i'll see how i feel i don't really care if it's an extra if i'm an extra out here an extra night um i do want to get to monson though i can tell you that right now i just i've never been to this this disgusting in my life and i'm just looking forward to getting a little bit of healing done a little bit of sleep as well so i'm gonna get on the trail i'm gonna get some water and get on the trail Well, got water, but fell in the water, so, <laughs> damn, these shoes are slippery on wet rocks, so dangerous, but, uh, I don't, it was only my feet that got submerged, not my whole body, so, um, so, so much for drying out my shoes and socks last night. They're freaking soaked again. We had a river crossing. I had to go in the water anyway in like seven miles. But that's seven miles away. So, uh, and there's still a lot of work. I think it's five miles actually now that I think about it. So there's still a lot of work to do between here and there. I wish the sun would come out. I'm just really love to have some heat in this body heat in all these joints heat in the underwear strapped to my pack that are soaked just uh i love to just dry things out a bit soggy wet i'm so demoralizing in the morning to get out of your uh to get out of your tent well of course I wasn't in a tent last night but get out of your uh, quilt in your nice warm Patagonia Capilene 4 you know leggings and stuff to put on wet freaking clothes so that's a that's something I'm gonna think about in the future and you know maybe start drying clothes out at night or or whatever, especially if they're wet, like from rain or something, but, uh, so I got a little bit, about the same start as yesterday, um, a little bit better day today, it's not raining, pretty much raining almost 
I rained all day on my entire hike yesterday. So I know I'm way behind the two folks that left at like 5.30 ish. Uh, so, and they're, I think they're both pressing on to try to make Monson in two days instead of three. Um, like I said, I don't really care. I mean, I do, but I don't. Uh, I'll end up seeing one of them in town probably. So, I really should probably put this away before I get wrecked in one of these damn roots. They're still wet, slimy, and gross. Plus, it's uh, slowing me down. I'm going to use, use the excuse why I'm going slow right now. <laughs> All right, let's get to it. We have a split, 1.2 West Branch, Pleasant River. Let's give that a whirl. Oh man, look at this nice little road. I could definitely use this right now. Oh, I mean, I don't even know how to explain it. I fell in the water twice this morning already. The shoes, I don't even know if they make a pair of trail runners that are going to stick to wet rocks and shit. I mean, really, these just could be worse than others, but, I mean, I sprained my ankle, I don't know, maybe three times today? Two times? Just, I mean, literally in the last 30 minutes, two times, and I fell both times. And I'm not talking about, oh, I sprain it and just, you know, rolled over. No, it's sprain it and it makes you kind of run a little bit and just face plant. I mean, natural instinction is to turn to your side, and I do, um, and I did. But palm hurt my palm. Didn't hurt my shoulder this time, but I... Uh, I have to set up a GoFundMe for a pair of ankles. Jeez, crazy. I don't know what it is. Right now, I think I'm just really trying to uh, kind of, I don't know, trying to favor another one or favor, oh shoot. I don't know what I'm doing, it's just, I have no energy right now. That's partly it too, but um, I gotta eat like every half hour something. Even if you're hungry, if you're hungry or not, you still gotta eat. But I'm not eating nearly enough calories I should be eating out here, but uh, I really, you know, that'll change in a few days because the body will get stronger, have some eggs, bacon, steak, or whatever in town and just recuperate a bit um really just attend to some issues um i got some sores on my feet that have n they're not they're not um what they're not what's the word i'm looking for they're not blisters people probably think they're blisters but they're not it's uh they're just tears from your ankle going sideways but uh I really need to conserve the battery because I don't think I have enough battery to record all the way to Monson. So, all right, I'm gonna uh, get back to this trail. This is a beautiful trail here. I could probably make some pretty good time here. Maybe I'll uh, bring up the video when I get to the river crossing. Point two to the river crossing, four miles to Cherubac. So, uh, all right, well. Let's see what this river crossing looks like. There's the river. Need to go across. And I'm just getting my feet ready here. Got these Walmart specials. Um, that I'm gonna wear across. And look at this ankle. It's just so jacked up looking right now. 
like that's the tear I'm talking about when you your side of your shoe like slips on something the sock just tears oops you can't even see it this is what I'm talking about right here where when your shoe is on the side of something and then you try to go up it just it slips and then your sock tears the skin right there it happened on this side as well so um, in the back the Keeleys I figured out what that was that's just me not wearing the socks correctly uh, that day so um, this, this KT tape probably come off I don't have a lot of KT tape with me either but um, I'm gonna put these um, Walmart specials on get across hope that water feels good on my ankles and uh, and then I'll reset up over there all right, here we go. I'm gonna try to I'm gonna try to record this, so it only gives me one hand. Oh my God, that's cold as hell. I'm gonna try to record this. Probably fall, but this is you know recording. Oh my God, that's freezing. Oh yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna get across here with recording hand. A fucking oops, that was slippery. Any hurry, Dave? Yeah, I am, because it's freezing. This is probably the deepest, maybe right here. God, those rocks are so slippery. Yep, so much for my pant legs, they just fell down. Be honest with you, sandals is not the best thing to be doing this in. Be almost better off. And there it goes. Made it across, as you can see, I <laughs> fell in. Um, I mean, I got water in every pocket. Fell in twice, actually, and I think it stopped recording right when I fell in the second time. Um, I'm soaked all the way up, but I'm across. I'll live, I'll survive, who cares, you know, it's just water. Um, I still sucked, but as I was saying, sandals like these, these hunks of garbage, five dollars from Walmart are not what you should be doing that and you should have like full-blown uh, Tevas or whatever the heck they call it, Tevos I don't know what they call them they call them something where they strap to you you know that's what you should be crossing the fin not not freaking sandals and that's the reason why I fell is because of the sandals because they kept coming off and trying to float down the freaking river so I uh, that's what made me fall anyways I'm gonna get reset up here and then uh, I have to try climbing this mountain. Raining again. That's the trail. That's what I'm going up. Another six, seven hundred feet. And it's murder. Just stepped in a, I don't know, a foot deep freaking pool of water. But, uh, what are you going to do? Caught in between, so... All right, let's get trucking. Well, looks like we got to go up. Can't even tell really how steep that is, but that's super steep. And you gotta follow those white slashes or white blazes all the way up. 
This is a uh, chair back. Fortunately, it's uh, not clear today. I wish it was because this would be super. This would be a lot easier if it was. I'm on top of a uh, chair back, and there's really nothing to record up here. It's, it's just cloudy and windy. So that's it. I'm not going to uh, record anything else. I got to get down and out of here to lean to. Day nine. I don't know about wilderness. Really conserving battery at this point. I got 29% left. All my expansion batteries are dead. And I got another day to go. So recording is gonna be limited big time. Chair back, third mountain today. Well, third mountain. And one more, chair back fourth. Uh, this is the third mountain today that I'm going to, well, I'll have to do three today. This is the second one. I have no idea where I came from, nor do I really care. <laughs> I'm beat. All right, uh, let's get to it. Top of Barren Mountain. Not really sure where, where, where it is, but whatever. Uh, Still thought I'd get the shot, so. Still 3.1 away from the shelter. Not going to the one I planned on to tonight. It's another five miles plus that, so. Uh, stay at a different one. About 3.1 miles away from here. Give us like a 14, 15 mile in the tomorrow, which I feel like for. All right. One point three to the lean two for tonight. I am dead. In the shelter, uh, long pond, uh, lean two. Just me and Cody here. We did basically roughly ten miles today. We we're supposed to do. Well, he never planned on it, but I planned on doing fifteen. But I'm just beat to hell, so. There's 15 miles left to Monson. I'm gonna try to do that tomorrow. It's not gonna be easy. Um, people are pretty much living on ibuprofen, and um, I keep having to borrow some because I don't. I ran out. I didn't bring that many, and I've twisted my ankle, sprained my ankle so many times, both ankles, so many times that. If you don't take ibuprofen, you're never going to get out of here. <laughs> so, I'm pretty much borrowing some. I just asked him for three tonight. And, uh, if it wasn't for that, I wouldn't make it to Monson tomorrow. So, I mean, I can split it up. I have enough food to split it up. Um, to seven miles, seven miles, or five and five, or, or five and ten, or something. I mean, I can split it up if I need to. But I hope I don't need to. I hope I can make it to 15 tomorrow. It's not too difficult of a day. Today was pretty rough. It was four or five, four mountains today. And it just beats you to hell because it's not, it's, it's so, I mean, it, it's, 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 I can't even explain it. And even when I record it, it just does not really show how rough the 100 mile wilderness is so I he even let me borrow his charger because my batteries are shot so um, he I charged my phone up with his battery so I appreciate that and um, hopefully I make it to Monson tomorrow so I'm gonna sign out and get some sleep all right talk to you later